Hello everybody, welcome to part 3 of my let's play of Jack and Daxter the Precursor Legacy. As you may know by now, if you're this far in the series, I am Pikesnail68. Or, you know, you just clicked on part 3 for whatever reason you wanted to, you wouldn't know that. But, anyways, last time, we made it about 75-80% to 80 of the way through the Forbidden Jungle. This time, we will be finishing up what we have left to do here. Now, if I'm correct, uh, if I can get over there without dying or fighting with Ka. Oh, yeah, long movie. No, how in the world do I do that? Oh, wait, it's literally just I have to break it down somehow. Oh my, why would you fall, Jack? An idiot! An idiot, I say! Whoa. Great drop on a PS2 platformer? What? That's what I had to do. I'm just stupid. And I couldn't hear Daxter. He said something about it early. Those tower doohickeys scattered all over the jungle must redirect the eco beam. Let's go fiddle with it. We can't hear Daxter. Uh, so last time we defeat, we also defeated um, Parasitic Plant Manhandler, and now all of his tentacles that were around the jungle and when it tried to attack us, we got near them are dead, like he is. Line up the beam by pointing it at the next tower. Don't cross the beams! Don't cross beams! Oh, come on, really? The freaking piranha fish thing. Ugh. Why does that one only always go up so little? It's weird. It's, I think it's the only one that does that too, where it just goes up a very short height compared to the others. Are you kidding me? I'm a terrible human being with these wannabe puns. Yeah, that's the last scout fly. I forget how to get over there. So, since I believe that's the last tower, we're gonna make a quick deep. In fact, do I have all the. Oh god, there's 150 in this area? And I'm, I'm missing six again, of course. I, I have a feeling that I'm gonna be doing that a lot where I'm missing six friggin'. There's four. I want to say five and six are with it. Uh, before 
I even... <clears throat> Screw you guys. You can't even sneak up on these guys because they hear you from like a mile of the way. Cough, cough, take a hint. All video game, all stealth game enemies. Or even just the Sly Cooper flashlight guards. Because if anything, they're the ones that need to know things from far away. Okay, I ran up here earlier. I couldn't see anything. And there's the six that I was missing. Of course, I am a stupid human being. <sighs> but some Sam's Choice Purified Drinking Water from Walmart is just what I need to make myself feel better. Kill you. <laughs> that guy, he is still laughing down there. Okay, and that is all we have to do in Forbidden Jungle. Of course, we have to talk to the mayor to get that precursor orb for that, but... Yep, that's all we had to do in there. So, I will see you guys next time. I'm joking. We're gonna, um... Let's go check out old fish at the dock. We'll do that later, Daxter. Uh... So, we're going to talk to the mayor, get the precursor over for doing the power for him. Oh, what a wonderful sight. I thank you. I know you thank me. Uh, boys, you have restored power to the village and guaranteed my re-election. And for that, my boy, you earned a power. He has it in his hat. And also, we restored the power for you. That should guarantee our straight-up election, not your re-election. But whatever, dude. So, next we have to do is, I'm not going to do all of the precursor orbs, all of the power cells related to purchasing. I'm going to save those for when we're fixing to leave Sandover Village. So, next we have up is... Sentinel Beach. With the crab enemies, of course. Because, you know, at the beach, you gotta have crab enemies when you're on the beach. 251, Celebi. Not being a good look at that enemy because I was too trigger happy. Uh. What are these things supposed to be? If anyone can look that up for me and, you know, tell me what it is down in the comments, I would really like to know. I will do this now. Hey! That pelican just snagged a power cell! Let's go kick some big bird butt! Yeah. That pelican gets the power cell before we're able to do it ourselves. Alright! Trigger! Okay, these things look like, um... And I don't know the actual terms of these. Those little, um... You can buy them, and they're like little white paper balls filled with, like, some sort of, like, small explosive or something. And you can throw them down, and those will make, like, a loud popping sound. And I think they sting a lot if they actually hit human flesh. But, um, I swear, that is what these things look like. Tell me I'm wrong. Okay. These sting a lot more than those do, I can tell you that. 
Come on. Hit me. Wow. He really did hit me. Okay. Collect these. And I believe this is the last metal box here. Oh, come on. Really? That should hit it. Yep. Okay, we're done with forcing that dude to shoot the metal boxes for us. Okay, this is the most misleading power cell. Right after the freaking pelican snatches that one over there. They just have this one thrown out in the open for us. Makes perfect sense, game. Makes perfect sense. Why did I turn into a cat right there? Oh, doggy. And you're dead. Yay, more boxes. Okay. If Jack is strong enough to just bust open those boxes with his fist... Like, legit, like, talk to Laura Croft or Nathan Drake. Someone who opens treasure chest, Link. Anyone who opens treasure chest during, like, their daily lives, basically. Talk to them. They probably pay you a fortune for helping out. Because they need to always, like, find keys for this stuff. You just punch and it opens. Okay, I know I'm going on a set trail right now, but... We do need to hop down in the water because not only is there some precursor ores behind this waterfall, but there are some in the water. Yep. How Daxter just makes the whale slash submarine sound whenever you dive. Or at least the first time you dive. All the stuff in the water? Nope, there's some over there. Okay, now I think that's all the ones in the water. If we're missing a multiple of four, I know that it's gonna be in the water. God, go so far. Go, Jack, me boy, go. I know I could probably use that windmill over there, but this is faster, I believe. Nailed it, first try. And the Pelican's just now passing that little windmill lighthouse thingy right there. Windmill, not a lighthouse. Two very different things, Brendan. Okay, I thought those flowers were orbs. I was just rolling around then, didn't mean to hit into that. And yes, I know there's a scout fly down there somewhere. I'll get it in a moment. Uh, and as Samo said earlier, I need to knock the rocks off of his green eco harvesters. So, let's let us do that. Well, I see that you two have finally decided to unblock my collectors. I would offer my congratulations, but you have so much to do, I won't waste your time. By the way, if things don't work out, Daxter could always get a job controlling the village rat problem. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's terrible. That is terrible. 
the same ropes. I hate killing those things. They're dogs. But I have to because they're gonna hurt me if I don't. Doesn't. Never mind. I'm. I can't talk about that. Uh. Oh right. I gotta go do this as well. Yeah. I'm just gonna be running around doing stuff as I think about them rather than just as I see them for most of the time. Just cause that's how I feel this game works is you're supposed to do stuff in whatever way you feel like and the way I feel like is just doing them in the order that I think about them and, and see them in some cases. So for example, I went and did the eco harvesters over there when I saw them and then I saw this area, so I was thinking ahead and doing it, and... I don't know. I'm here. Uh oh, God. That's it. Just a little further. Oh, God. Crazy bird lady. Hold on. Give me one moment, woman. Un momento, por favor. I don't speak Spanish. No habla español. Are you near the egg yet? No, woman. I'm getting some precursor eggs right orbs right now. Push the egg off the cliff. Oh. That is hurting the creature inside, by the way. Jesus Christ. Meet me down here by the egg. Go bunga. Oh my. I hope the poor dears We punched it off a cliff. Why does... Okay. Why does it go to Daxter for its mama? Because he's more animal looking than Jack or Crazy Bird Lady? I I'm going to assume that as canon and say yes. God, that blue eco is just fine? Or is it just loading in as I get close to it? Can't really tell. Knows that way earlier, and I should have gotten it, but I was too focused on the pelican, and then other things happened. Punch those poles up from below. I forget how to punch up. That works. Okay, so it's just hold R1 and then. And then hit square to punch. Right. Not too hard. Uh, there's no need to really get up there from here, is there? Back over here, guys! Compelling gameplay. Swimming. Nailed it. Look at all the butterflies. I have so many alchemy ingredients in this with Skyrim. Holy god, so many butterflies. You know, I don't really do out. I don't really make potions that much in my game. Alchemy is hard in that game, guys, okay? I usually stick to just magic and enchanting and stuff. Not like this thief style stuff that everybody seems to be a fan of. Which speaking of, uh, Skyrim Remaster, I'm gonna have fun playing that. Don't know about you guys. I've been waiting for an updated looking, at the very least, Skyrim for a while now. Because I've had to move my 360 in my living room, which is a 4K TV, and 
Skyrim looked good, like, damn good when it came out. But after, like, 2011 ended and all the DLC for it came out, it looks like shit nowadays. I am sorry. That game looks terrible. 720, 1080, you name it. But if you put it into 4K, like the TV in my living room is, good God, it is unplayable. Like, obviously your eyes will adjust to it after a while, so it will become playable. But even then, it just looks disgusting in 4K. Like, I never really understood what one of my friends meant whenever he'd say that his eyes would be bleeding if, you know, he played Skyrim. After seeing it in 4K, I can relate because... Okay, I need to get off the Skyrim tangent because this is not Skyrim. This is Jack and Baxter, the Precursor Legacy. Not for the Xbox 360, PS3, or PC but for the good old-fashioned great system of all time PS2. Statistics, not opinion. <laughs> Daxter is like having too much fun scaring the seagulls. You're in the wrong game to be doing the robot, Daxter, just saying. Okay, we've been going for a while now. Um, uh, so we're going to finish up Sentinel Beach next time, guys. All right, so I will see you then. Goodbye.